Hi, we're down here at the fair and I just want to give a shout out that we're going to be here till Sunday it's here at the art building and um, there's a ton of art to look at here. I have my watercolors here in the featured artist corner but um, there's every medium, there's children's art, so come on down. I was gone a lot Hello, my name is Patrick Voles. I live in Colchester, Vermont, and we're here at the Champlain Valley Fair 2014. And this is my painting. Um, it was uh, actually a photograph that was taken about nine years ago, and it was a photograph that was taken right here at this fair. And so um, I just got around to uh, painting it this past year. And uh, it was about a year working off and on, mostly off, uh, to, to do it. And uh, I've done about about 10 paintings or so by this point. So, yeah, it's, it's a hobby. Yeah, is this your first time at the fair? No, I enter, actually entered, um, this is my second time at the fair. My first time entering some paintings at the fair was two years ago, and my acrylic came in f uh, second place. And I also entered a um, an oil at that time, and so the the oil category here at this fair is a uh, very very tough competition. So maybe better luck next time. <laughs> so the first one we're going to do best in show is painting and drawing, and that's Martha Oliger from Fairfield. Um, you've got to look at her picture. It's the one up at the top there with the jars, but she's painted a scene inside the jars. So take a good look at it later, okay? Yeah, and it's called Preserving Summer. <laughs> I'm Marilyn Van Houten, and I'm the assistant superintendent in the art gallery. And I'm Gina Dufresne, the superintendent of the art gallery at the Champlain Valley Fair. Tonight was our um, award night for the artists and the artist reception, and we had uh, we give out the we have already given all the awards, and now we're recognizing them as a big group. So we recognize all, all the first, second, third, and honorable mention in every category that we have. It's been good. Sometimes, if we, we've counted the crowds in here, sometimes we have 80 to 100 people in here. Sometimes wandering around. The nice thing is, it's air conditioned and it's accessible to strollers and wheelchairs. And the artist always amazes what they put in. Yeah. It's just always creative, energetic. It just fits the categories well. It's just wonderful. I, I always call it eye candy <laughs> because it, there's so much good stuff to see, and we're really getting some top work here. You know, it's amazing what's in Chittenden County and Vermont as far as the artwork that's being produced. And about half of it's for sale, so you can come pick up a nice piece for your work, your wall. Right. And we have people come from, they come on opening day, they come up here from New York even and buy artwork because they feel like they, they're going to be able to have a nice selection. I have to tell you too that this is Janet's 23rd year as superintendent of the art gallery and it's my 20th year. So we've been doing this a long time. And we're very lucky, we pretty much have the same crew of, um, there's about a dozen of us. I was just telling her that Janet and Marilyn I've been doing this for over 23 years. Oh yeah, we, we've been yeah. at it quite a while. Yeah, and yeah. He had, he's been here too, yeah. for that number of years. I've been along with everybody. How is it this year so far? Good. Good? Yeah. yeah. A lot of people? Or? Well, quite a few. Especially tonight. Yeah. A lot of people. All right. Well, thank you very much. We're done with the camera.